you go to images as well to see if you're fucked up. <laughs> like this guy, just fucked up. <laughs> no, I'll sit, I'll sit as a cat in the weedy bit. That's how I sit that way. You remember a cat in the weedy bit? That was my favourite story of last year. I wasn't even in the country at the time, I was in Slough, right? In the county, right? But they were talking about it all over the world. And American news, Australian news, it's like, how dare this lady do that? How dare she do such a thing? Everybody knows cats goes in a brown bin, everybody knows. And they were knocking on the doors like, what lady, what? Needs to come out and say sorry to the cat. Right, they're going. He's a cunt, 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 he's a cunt. Someone take him home. Oh, There's a little lady that put a cat in the weedy bin, right? I mean, all she had, right, was a moment of madness. Everyone agree? That's what she had. It was a moment of madness. We have these things in our head all of the time, but we don't choose to act it out. Good. You know what I mean? When you're a child, you can get away with it. I think that power comes back to you when you're about 60. You can. You can do whatever you want when you're 60. You might be at a tube station and you see someone in front of you and you think, I'm going to push them. But you don't do it. Because it's wrong. It's right. You might be at a gym and you see a fat person walking on a treadmill. And you think to yourself, run fat, you run, but you can't say it. Because it's wrong and you can't go into the machine and push it to make them run faster either, can you? Because it's wrong. You would be walking around the street, right? And you see an ugly girl pushing a buggy and you think to yourself, who fucked that? <laughs> even the babies in the... Like, I don't even know how I got it. Must have been a super injunction or something. What's your name, baby? Fuck up. 